हेलो फ्रेंड्स अस्सलाम वालेकुम एंड वेलकम टू माय न्यू वीडियो फ्रेंड्स व्हाट आई एम गोइंग टू टेल इन दिस वीडियो इज रियली मच इंटरेस्टिंग बिकॉज इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू स्ट्रेंज स्पेस कॉन्स्पिरसीज जस्ट वांट गो Okay so friends let get start our video without any delay Our first one is fake moon landing 12 NASA astronaut walked on a moon between 1969 and 1972 and the lunar reconnaissance orbiter has since released photo of the landing sites in the decades since Apollo 11 astronauts first set foot on the moon many theories have been put claiming that the whole apollo program was staged why are there no stars in the sky in the moon walkers photos why are the us flag fluttering on the surface why do you see footprint in the picture but no marks from the lunar module that landed there the to those question are simpler than you think There are no stars in the sky for the same reason you don't see stars during the day on earth according to NASA. The bright glow of daylight on the surface washes them out. US flag planted into the lunar soil ahead metal rod showing in them to appear as through they were moving according to NASA. Without this wire the flag would have hung straight down. making for a pretty lackluster photo prop and the lunar module through heavier didn't put prominent mark in the surface in some place because their mass was more evenly distributed than the astronauts weight was in their boots and the next one is earth is flat this myth is so popular that there is even a group named after it The Flag Earth Society, member of the uh, organization, argue that the horizon is always at eye level, which they say would not be possible if the Earth were round. They also say there is no full movie of the Earth rotating them in space, which is not true, as NASA has published multiple video taking from satellite, including a live video from the ISS. which orbit our planet 16 time per day one way of demonstrating to yourself that the earth is round is to consider how orbit of satellite work satellites constantly fall around the earth as they are pulled around by our planet's gravity they just need to be traveling fast enough at a high enough altitude to not slam into the atmosphere or you can look at the amazing picture taken by astronaut at iss and next one is planet 9 will kill us in april 2016 the new york post tweeted a newly discovered planet could destroy earth as soon as this month the newspaper was referring to planet 9 a theoretical planet at the edge of the solar system an accompanying video also claimed that the new planet would be throwing all sort of asteroid and comet at earth which would supposedly end up pummeling earth all through the planet existence has not confirmed astronomers are actively looking for it to explain motion of some object in the icy kuiper belt a vast region of icy object beyond neptune if the planet is actually found the planet will pose no threat to us according to the california institute of technology mike brown and the next one is a face on mars in 1976 the sa viking one spacecraft took a picture of what appeared to be a face on mars immediately some people said there must have been alien on the red planet that left their face behind as evidence of their existence nasa however 
pointed out that the suspected face is really just a pile of rock casting shadows that resemble face like features nasa followed up with better resolution from the mars global surveyor in 1998 and 2001 respectively these new images made it quite clear that the face on mars is nothing more than a trick of light and shadows on a completely normal martian mound and the last one is area 51 the 1996 movie independence day is one of the source of the area 51 hoax which claim that alien and their technology recovered from crashed flying saucers are being studied secretly at a classified military air base about 80 miles northwest of las vegas in the nevada desert some people in the area around the base claim that they have been a strange flight out of the area while area 51 true focus is classified the us government has acknowledged its existence a part of edward air base the area was known high location or high technology airplane flight in the 1960 and 1970 it flight serve as a proving ground for lockhead u2 a 812 oxcart his spy plane as early as 1955 ufo sighting reported in the area was indeed an identified object but only because the plane were top secret not because they were flown by aliens so friends that's all for today i hope you guys like the video comment us your interesting conspiracy we will meet in next video for that take care